Hello and thanks for tuning in. If you're here, it's because you want to take your mannequin in Unreal Engine 5 and replace it with Paragon characters. So of course you're going to want to add to the cart, download, add to your project. I'm sure you know how to do that part. So you want to take your mannequin and turn your mannequin into, into this. Then allow me to show you how to do so really quickly. Alright, let's get right into it. So the first thing you're going to want to do is exit out of play mode, go into your content drawer. Under content, you're going to want to head to the third person folder, go into blueprints. Then click on blueprint third person character, double click. Go up here to viewport and click on the mannequin. Over here near mesh, you're going to want to click on the drop down menu and find the characters you've added. Once you're in there, you're going to want to double click on the desired character. You're going to have to give it a minute in order to let it load its shaders. I've already done that for you, so we can move along. Then you're going to want to come into animations. See here we have animations. And you're going to want to go into animation class. And you're going to want to find the animation for the character that you have selected. Then you're going to want to hit save. That's up here. And then you can close this window. When you hit play, you will have your desired character. If you want to see that again, let me show you another character. You exit out of the play mode. You go content drawer. You go into the content folder. You go into the third person folder. You go into the blueprints. You double click on the blueprint. You move up to the viewport. You click on the character. You go over to the mesh category. You go up into finding a desired character. And once you've clicked it, you're going to need to let the shaders will pop up here. You need to let them load. And you go into the animation. I think that's the one. There we go. And then you're going to want to save it. Yep. And then you can close it here. And then when you hit play, you have another character. Now this character flies, which is pretty neat. And again, if you want to change that, I'll show you one more time. Close the play, content drawer, double click, blueprint, go into viewport, click the character, go under mesh, and find your desired character, let the shaders load, go into the animation, find the animation you need, hit save, close this window, and then hit play. It is very simple to do it once you know how. Don't feel bad if you didn't know, because you have to learn first. Other tutorials are very, very slow to teach you what you need, and I figured I'd just make something nice because I learned how to do it, and it's a lot quicker and easier than some of those tutorials are making it out to be. Alright, I hope you guys enjoy your day. Please like, subscribe, and have a good time. Thanks, bye-bye.